Hey guys, it's Melissa here. Hope you're all doing really well. I get so many questions on what equipment I use to film my videos and what software I use to edit them. So I thought I'd make a video about it. So I record my video and my audio separately. So here are the things that I use to record my audio. So first things first, I record all my audio on this thing right here. It is the Zoom H6 audio recorder. And I use it in conjunction with a microphone. The microphone that I use is this microphone right here. It is Dynamic Shure SM57 microphone. Now I've done loads of research on microphones and I picked this one because it has really good reviews and it's supposed to be a really great microphone, which it is, but there are better ones out there to record acoustic instruments, um, which I only discovered after I bought this one. So if I could go back in time, I wouldn't actually purchase this one. Um, but it does a good job anyway. So it's connected with a cord to my audio recorder and I basically just play into this and this catches everything, all the sound and then it's recorded on this SD card which I remove and put into my computer and then edit the audio on GarageBand. Now, I don't edit it too much, I just put a little bit of reverb and atmosphere so I don't touch the pitch or the tone of my flute. Um, but that all depends on this microphone. So, or on a microphone, or any microphone that you choose to use. So make sure that your microphone is a really good one. So I'm still on the hunt for a good microphone, so if you guys have any suggestions on the microphone that I should get next, please leave a comment down below. That would be great. Okay, so on to filming the video. So the camera that I use is the 600D um, from Canon, and I bought this secondhand on eBay like years ago. Um, if you are on the hunt for a Canon camera, I would suggest getting the upgrade to this one which is the 70D. Um, if I had to buy a new camera, I'd probably get that one um, because it also has a flip out screen, just like the 600D. And it has video autofocus. So you don't need to kind of stand still in one place. You can move about and the camera will adjust to wherever you are. So the lens that came with this camera is the EFS 18 to 55 millimeter lens. And I went ahead and purchased the Sigma 1.4 30mm lens. Um, and the reason why I purchased this one was because it makes the background all pretty and blurry and it brings you into the forefront. Um, and I just really, really like this, this lens. So I also purchased this thingy-mabob and it is a Canon remote, which is really, really handy. It's only a couple of quid. So really affordable and basically you can press um, record from really far away and you can focus from really far away if you have no one else to focus for you. So moving on, I do have lights to light my videos. I have two soft boxes which I purchased from Amazon a couple of years ago. They were £100 for two um, and they work really well and they've lasted me um, years. So I would definitely recommend them. I'll see if I can find the exact ones, but if not, I'm sure they would have gone down in price by now. I do use a tripod for my camera and it is a really basic one. It's by Manfrotto. So I think that is it for my video setup. Um, once I finish filming, I take the SD card out of my camera and pop it into my computer and I edit um, the video on Final Cut Pro. So I import the audio and sync the video and the audio up. So it is really me playing. Sometimes it doesn't look like it's me playing because of syncing issues or maybe I didn't do a very good job in the edit. Um, but that's how I edit my videos. So one more thing before I go, I wanted to tell you guys that if you're thinking about 
um, making videos and you're thinking, oh my goodness, I don't have lights, I don't have a fancy camera, I don't have audio equipment, that doesn't matter. When I first started, if you look back to my first video, it was filmed through my MacBook Pro and it was just everything in one. So it was the audio from my computer, the video from my computer, um, and it was all in one take as well. So, you know, you have to start somewhere. I would love to see more flute players, trumpet players, clarinet players, singers making videos because I think it's really cool. I have fun making them so I'm sure you guys will have fun too. So I hope this has been a helpful video for you guys and I will see you in my next cover. Bye!